Welcome to the Komatsu Virtual Event at Mind Expo 2021, right here in Las Vegas. I'm Madison Alexander, your host in the Komatsu Truck Bed Studio. Underground hard rock mining is one of the most challenging environments. Komatsu is working to develop innovations that help hard rock miners boost productivity and sustainability while promoting a zero harm mentality. One of these advances is Komatsu's innovative new MC-51 machine. Our very own Natalia Bilbao is down on the show floor to show us the new MC-51 and tell us how it can boost your operation. Natalia, this is a new machine in the Komatsu mining family. If you don't mind, can you give us the elevator pitch, if you will, before we get into the details? Absolutely, Madison, my pleasure. So the MC-51 is a continuous hard rock mining machine that uses a dynamic Dynacut undercutting technology. It has a cutter on a five axis robotic boom that can profile any shape within a five meter by five meter profile. It's more controlled than drill and blast as it reduces overbreak. That sounds very efficient. So it's kind of like a continuous miner for hard rock, is, is that right? Yeah, that's right, Madison. It is very efficient. It has a cutter head, loading arms, and a conveyor similar to a soft rock continuous miner. With it, you end up needing much less remedial cleanup work, less LHG support, and in some cases, less ground support because you haven't damaged the surrounding rock. I see. It sounds like Komatsu is really focused on safety and the journey to zero harm. Am I correct in that assumption? You are correct, Madison, very much so. The most obvious is that there's no blasting involved. And because the machine is totally electric, no diesel fumes either. Finally, there are fewer workers involved in the process. Earlier today, I talked with Steve Stiles, the product manager for the MC51. Hi, Steve, thank you so much for being here. And you've got to be extremely excited to be showing this new technology. I understand it's been a long time coming. Yes, it has, Natalia. Komatsu has been developing the Dynacut technology over several years. And we've been working hard to ensure it delivers the performance and reliability that Komatsu customers expect. So Steve, tell me more about the Dynacut technology and how it works. Sure. The cutter attacks the rock in an undercutting fashion. And in that way, it exploits the weaker tensile strength of the rock. Now this allows the machine to be small and agile with a very low power requirement. Now, there are tons of benefits to this new technology. So, is this a replacement for drill and blast mining methods? Well, that's a great question, Natalia. It is positioned to be an alternative to drill and blast, but it will complement existing mining methods. The MC-51 with Dynacut offer additional advantages. It is especially good in applications where tunnel quality and zero emissions are important. It is very controlled and focused. Also, the MC-51 can mine areas where drill and blast may not be commercially feasible. For example, small remote ore bodies, selective mineral mining, or even under surface infrastructure which needs to remain intact. Okay, so from what I understand, you're getting help from customers and implementation and validation of the MC-51 capabilities. Uh, yes, yes we are. Now Vale is one of our customers in Canada and they are conducting an underground mining trial with the MC-51 right now. They say it aligns with their strategy to prioritize the transition from diesel to electrified products and the desire to advance continuous mining methods for productivity and safety. Now, we worked closely with them to choose a site to further test and validate the technology. And prior to mobilizing the MC-51 in Canada, we ran a successful underground trial at an Australian gold mine with Newcrest. And this has really helped us prepare for the upcoming trial with Vale and one of their Canadian nickel mines. Well, thank you so much for being here, Steve, and sharing all this very valuable information with us. Thanks, Natalia, for stopping by. Enjoy the rest of the show today. So representatives from Vale were in the Komatsu booth earlier today talking about the relationship with Komatsu on the MC-51. Hi, Mike. Thank you very much for the introduction. Uh, yes, uh, here at Komatsu, we've been doing research on uh, ways to break rock 
uh, in a predictable way on a fully electric system over the last 10 years. Throughout that time period, we've been collaborating and partnering with customers to really understand how do we bring this technology to the market. So what we have today is a mechanical rock cutting system that you'll see on the back end of that rock wall. This machine, the MC51, is uh, designed to allow our customers to implement alternative ways of mining by requiring less pieces of equipment to reach their ore bodies. So what it effectively does is allowing them to do more with less. Uh, that also provides a great platform for our customers in the simplified method of mining to automate that process. And by doing that, allowing our customers to take that operator further away from the mining phase. So today we have Vale here, and Vale being one of the largest iron ore and nickel producers in the world, they're collaborating with us. And the intent of the partnership is to bring this technology to the market quicker for them in an accelerated fashion, as well as for our under customers. Dina. Thanks, Rudy. It's uh, fantastic to be here representing Vale and talking about the partnership we have with you on the MC51. Um, the MC51 is currently in operation uh, in one of our mines in Sudbury, in Garson, two and a half kilometres underground. Um, and I want to talk a bit about the partnership we have had with Komatsu over the years. And, and for me, it's, it's, it's really, really critical that we do work together to solve some of the very real challenges that we have. And you talked about one of the ones that keeps me awake at night. So conventional cutting technology, if you haven't already understood, involves using drill and bast um, to break away the rock so we can get in there and move it. The technology you'll see in the video shortly does away with that entire step. And if you can imagine right now around the world, we have many of our colleagues uh, exposed to that risk each and every day. So for me, this is a fantastic collaboration which solves a very, very real safety challenge that our industry has. Uh, so I couldn't be prouder standing here. Um, and I thank you, Rudy, for the work you and your team have done. And also the folks here uh, who have been working tirelessly to make this happen. So why don't we have a look at uh, what's on show? What is the MC51 and Dynacut technology? At Vale, we're obsessed with safety. Komatsu and Vale are excited to be working together as collaborators on this new safety and productivity driven solution. We are trialing this new machine and technology because it offers the potential to really change the way we mine. The Dynacut mechanical cutter technology provides a very controllable way of cutting rock and the machine itself the MC51 is designed to advance more sustainable mining methods by reducing the amount of equipment required for mining underground. This mechanical cutter machine aligns with our safety and sustainability goals to enable continuous and precise rock breaking through a fully electric system that outputs zero emissions. By automating and controlling the processes so the machine can be operated remotely via line of sight, we now have the opportunity to move our operators further from the cutting face and from harm's way. The pace of innovation required right now in the face of undeniable climate change is something none of us can do alone. We have to work together, sharing resources and information to find these sustainable solutions quickly. And at the same time, we need to keep pace with demand for essential minerals. Society needs these core elements to create sustainable energy solutions, including solar panels and wind turbines, as well as many modern necessities such as phones and computers. As an industry, we have to come together to rapidly advance technologies and innovate mining methods in order to continue meeting society's expectation alongside its needs for essential minerals. Our industry has very real challenges, such as improving worker safety, reducing and eliminating emissions, minimizing our mine footprints, and finding alternative methods for obtaining ore, all of which we can solve through innovation. Komatsu and Vale have entered into a partnership to advance the future of rock excavation by collaborating to optimize Komatsu's mechanical cutting technology. This partnership to trial this machinery is that first step to really prove and understand the technology as it relates to cutting through hard rock. 
while meeting our high standards for safety. This mechanical rock cutter trial will be the largest of its kind ever undertaken. Our intent is to test the ability of the technology to not only cut the very hard rock of the Canadian Shield, but to challenge the technology to cut at a commercial rate that will compete with traditional drill and blast development. The ability of the cutter to integrate with existing infrastructure and equipment within our current process at the mine, that is bolters, trucks, and scoops, is the key to implementing this technology. Valet plans to demonstrate the ability to cut rock at a commercial rate, quantify the cost per meter of operation, and look at the comparison with the conventional drill and blast development. At the same time, we will assess the health and safety and environmental suitability of the mechanical rock excavation process and gain insight into the potential of an optimized mechanical rock excavation process for the future. We have planned a 400 meter or 1300 foot trial over 12 months in an active operating mine and the trial will in part be supported by our valet operations crews. We have already brought the Komatsu rock cutting machine from Australia to Valet's Garson Mine in Sudbury, Ontario, Canada, where the final assembly of the machine is currently being completed underground and the testing will shortly begin. True innovation requires effective collaboration between the end user and suppliers to ensure the technology developed best meets the needs of the industry. So the partnership with Komatsu is an opportunity to optimize existing and new processes to get the best outcome for mechanical cutting equipment. The launch of the MC-51 is a very exciting development in the industry for Komatsu and for our customers alike. There's certain to be a lot of buzz on the MC-51 throughout Mine Expo. You can learn more about this machine in the Komatsu virtual event site. Feel free to reach out through the site's chat function if you have any questions. There's a lot to see in the Komatsu display at Mine Expo 2021. Thanks for watching.